I believe he's only scouted one, but he tagged him here quite heavily. It's going to be the breach quite lit, but most of Tadox now stacking up as they will smoke off heaven. Mm -hmm. They also saw the fault line coming through, so they're going to make those rotations really, really fast. Jets are so wow. far away, but that's going to be Aduka going to be the first to go down. Seta finds two right off Beautiful. the bat. Dodges the fault line, gets oh. another one. Seta making sure this is going to work, but oh, they're still teleport. teleporting. Oh, he's still alive. The paranoia comes up. Okay, he doesn't see, but oh. unfortunately walks into the bullets. And Stax is going to be fighting that one. It's so a 1v1. I think RB is going to have this rotating around through screens. He might be able to get a little bit of a sneak attack going. Now, the spike has been retrieved by our rays. 50 seconds left on the round. More than enough time to plant, but I think they're going to be now trying to make a play to another site. The shot's not connecting here either way. So lit. Just about one hit there is going to be that raise, but RB, he's still looking quite healthy as the rays will be scouted mm. by the tripwire. Yeah, it's, I mean, there's still plenty of time here. She's, oh, Race is going to be playing through ramps. Oh, first hit, and immediately, that's going to broach, but they need to know what VS is overall. Oh, RB. RB, not yep. missing the shot. There we go. First shot, first kill here for RB. Out of that operator as he swings around through B main. It's only the Raze there that was actually sent to lurk. The rest of the team and the spike actually still continue to go through mid as Zest's uh, wall here is about to expire. Smoke's coming out. They know there's at least an enemy jet and probably more to follow. Mm -hmm. Yep, they're going to be walking oh, through and wow. Zess already finds one, finds a second one. That's going to be two pickoffs there, really big, but they're going to get counter fragged here. Is Breach able to take out Zest? They're going to be pushing up through mid side. They could look to rotate towards A, but B feels more likely. Yep. Um, indeed, as they will now back up, it's going to be a 3v2 again with full rifles here, but Vision Strikers, they're going to be able left. to pick up some uh, rifles now. Uh, actually, no, they will not, rather, as it's going to be Todak through the vents, rotating on over to the A site. Now, we do have a Cypher as well as his pesky camera here to try and dispatch of 18 seconds here, so they're going to have to make a push, but they've really got an advantage here, having control over Heaven. You can see King. He's shaking his head. Where are they coming? There they go. The dart will drop. Let's see if King can now get the drop here on a few enemies, as he will get the first now. The Doctor down for the count. Needs a medic for himself. The spike area is going to be dropped. Omen last oh. remaining member. Will side looking to Try and take control of B Heaven, Breach, and Sage, both in position. The flashpoint has been coming out. I thought I just have to bullshit back out, but it's going to be so unfortunate with everything just going wrong. They've already picked up one. Can they get another pick off? Oh, the no. RB with that flick, the perfect tracking. My goodness, stacks to follow up with a phantom kill as well in sight. However, B, there are rather two members of Todak in the site. Sana now currently holding the rafters, but they are going to get collapsed on. There's no escape here. Is trying to get through Bound 2. Instead, mm. will be traded away. Senna, can he get at least one more? JB, I'm sorry, RB rather, missing the operator shot, but stacks. Even though Vision Strikers will, of course, be able to, oh. to, to get money. What? RB? He already found the pickoff. Like, uh. he always manages to find a pickoff every single time we see him on this map, and it's just really, really tough to actually get past him at this yeah. point. He likes to play very aggressive as well on this operator. Very unpredictable. He's heaven. Now he's a long. Now he's going to go back into heaven watching ramps. Well, I imagine we might even see him get to lurk mid as we do have two members of Vision Strikers holding in uh, B heaven, as well as one in back of sight, but Todak. Oh man, 4v5 already on a map like Split. It's quite the uphill battle here, Gideon. Mm -hmm. It's quite, it's very spacious. Uh, sorry, it's it's a pretty wide map overall, but you know, there's just a lot of things that you could do with it. There's a lot of elevation differences. There's a lot of tight corridors that you're going to have to watch through. And that's why it's so defender side heavy because just getting into these sites are very, very difficult. But the post plan is just so, so good as well. So a lot of these teams, they just have to get over that first big hurdle before making anything happen. Mm -hmm. Slow but steady, but it's still going to be Glow regardless, finding a kill onto the Lurker. They're trying to fake him over to B, but Vision Strikers, they've not rotated too many over. Left. King is still here. He's going to be able to find one, maybe even the second before Sen is able to trade him away with that Vandal now. Zest up in heaven, and the rest of Vision Strikers rotating on over. They hear the spike being planted, I believe, as down it goes. That's a big win for Tadak. They really need all the credits they can get at this point. Mm-hmm. Yep. 2v4 but, but the hold is going to be so hard. Yeah, it really is because this position is just so, 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 so oh, difficult to win from. They've already got control of heaven, uh, from Heaven's Side. They're pushing through so much, oh. trying to get the shot, but unfortunately, he's going to get taken out by stacks coming in on the other side. Two angles can't hold them both. Yeah, very difficult, and that's going to be the fifth round. Decent eco damage done here, Division Strikers. Mm -hmm. That's very, very important here. You never want to let your enemy pushes here. It's just so strong as they will try and send the Owl Drone to push them back further uh, down events. The slow 
orb from Zest. He's gonna find two before he's traded away. Tanakto with a great peek as they will get stacked before he gets any damage in the rotation out from Cypher as well as the Omen standing behind them in uh, mid event. But RB holding a tight angle misses the first operator shot. Cypher considering going up, peeking towards heaven, but the site I think has now been taken by Tadak. They're gonna get another spike plant here. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, King, he finds one. Can he get a second one? The spike has already been dropped this time. Breach, unfortunately, looking in the wrong direction, gets headshot instantaneously. Blade Storm RB making sure he doesn't miss the shots. Yeah, he just indeed. Miss. He didn't want to risk using the ghost there. We've seen plenty of jets flying around, jet mm -hmm. airliners, just putting people down here, left, right, and center. And Vision Strike on Ascent didn't work out for them, but nearly did here as Tadak now in with the Blade Fury. He's trying to find any members that they've had. Actually, rotated around, flanked quite nice. But two members coming from Vent as the Hunter's Fear out from Subby to try and get more information. Tadak will find one onto Zest before getting traded away. Oh, Omen in some trouble, gets lit, but 22 HP. He's still going to live and get two kills right after. On the oh! members, King follows up with two of his own, and he's going to find the third to peek. Oh, this is going to be a tight angle. Will they be expecting the jet operator here? <laughs> nope. RB is going to open it up with the first. He takes plenty oh! of damage and actually gets walled by a Duke. Zest now will drop on down into the cubby as Stax attempts to slow down the push before calling for reinforcements. Yep, the reinforcements are holding heaven's side. They are dropping the spokes to block field of vision oh. glow. That's going to be him going down. Aduka tries to get the updraft, but finally the attack is these rounds, and it will still be okay. But it really depends whether or not RB is going to be losing, oh. but this time he finally does. It's going to be about to making sure that it works out. The oh, he oh, even a showstopper. The yeah. yeah, they get about half damage here. The paint shells will force him back. Lovely stuff there. They know RB likes to flex on them, shoot that operator at the boom buddy, and they are going to punish them very difficult, very hard here. Rather, Tadak will completely take control here of B. Around here would be huge, Gideon. And Subby's doing the, his best as he will be able to pick off the Omen. Mm -hmm. Yep, he's going to rotate all the way back here. Oh, oh, good revive, though, out from Zest. Of course, with that Sage, it is going to make it a 5v4 yet again. Yep, they're going to have to make this work. Oh, Flashpoint Big coming flash. out from Heaven's side as they look to try and rain, uh, rain down lead from the ground. They drop down from the ropes. Oh. This is going to be so awkward. Yeah, indeed, King. Now, we still have Bay 2 actually here. Still on the rafters as it's going to be the Cypher trying to save his money. Now, Tarak, they hold strong. They only lose the Jet that round. Their second round in a row. Vision Strikers, they still can probably afford to full buy yet again. Mm -hmm. But if they can get this exit frag, no, it's okay. They're really looking for it, though, because they recognize the situation. Buckles now B, and they're going to try three rounds in a row for the B rush. King here, he does have the cyber cages to try and slow down the push, as now they're going to know. Nice flash here. Aduka again with the ultimate, ready to go for Tadak. Looking to find one, will get one there with the updraft. But Zest, as well as the rest of the team, now going from behind. Heaven, though, has been cleared. It's going to be a three versus two scenario. Glow with the ulti. Can he scout for vision? Is he actually going to commit? No, but now he knows someone was watching that B garage. The spike will be planted. Mm -hmm. This is really, really good. Great use of the ultimate. However, it's a 1v3 situation, so every one of these bullets are going to have to count Jet. Sorry, a 2v3 situation with both Jet and Omen looking to control from Heaven's side. They are just out of... Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Looks like Omen is pushing up from the flank. This might be really, really huge as they look to cover it. Oh. One down. Subby is going to be the first to fall. They take one out. The flanker is gone, and now it's just Jet to make it happen. The blade zone doesn't actually hit through, and that's going to be Glow Shoot through the smoke. Yeah, at least he didn't get hit by a bullet. He was at 28 HP, but now so that's Balto what? trying to make the play. Unfortunately, it's going to be Glow did taking RB him out. Did he really just walk up that ladder, just that rope without getting shot once? I mean, we saw RB miss a lot of shots there after he panicked for the boom bot. Maybe wasn't expecting it a fourth time in a row, but mm -hmm. unfortunately, Tadak, they didn't get that much needed kill. They might have been able to get a spray transfer on over to the member in heaven. They didn't check their corners, though, just chasing down that jet and vision strikers. They're going to have a one-man advantage now, as we will see Tadak maybe try and push through mid here. I mean, it's a good case of just uh, tunnel visualing. Uh, the, the, when you're looking for somebody, you want to get that kill, especially when it's RB who's been re really dominating, uh, really dominating getting these picks almost every single time. It's good to say, hey, we got that kind of security off of the table, and now we can continue playing the game like usual. Most definitely here, and they are playing a good game at that for Vision Strikers. 30 seconds left in this round. It looks like Tadak, it was a fake towards A, but left. again, the Cypher's just been holding down that site. He knows it's his job. Zest as well there, just in case they decide to rotate more over. We will have RB holding a tight angle, but it's going to be Aduka. Finally, confidence under his belt will win the 1v1 versus RB. Mm-hmm. Oh, with the doctor following up as well with the frag, that's going to be B site under control. Oh, the flashes left. are coming. 
coming up strong. Reach didn't check his left though, but he does pull back. Unfortunately, that's going to be uh, Subby taking him oh, out as no. King walks into the site, gets traded off. Subby once oh, again, the spike? making it work. That's unbelievable. I actually can't believe they just managed to get that spike planted there. We're running out of time. It's a 1v2 here. It's all going to be up to Zest, who's now walking through site. Does not manage to. Okay, we're we got to end it strong. End they it do. Yeah, luckily for them, actually, King is not holding a ramp, which has really been the crux of this push now, as they mm -hmm. will be able to smoke off Heaven. Camera is going to scout them immediately. Are they going to spray through the smoke? Hunter Sphere out from Subby to try and tag anyone rotating through as Aduka gets the kill onto Glow. That's a big one, but the double spray out from King, who I'm pretty sure gets two kills with one shot there. Nothing to really wall through. Yeah, it, it's uh, it's pretty tough. He peeks up from elbow side. Ooh, he does see he he does see one, and then spots on the second one from the track of dark. King, he needs to make this work out. Oh, spots on the wow. foot. Oh, Raze makes it happen. He wants to say. Oh, oh, he's not gonna get it. RB is gonna snap hot half, so yeah, he's, he's definitely gonna be like you know feeling himself a little bit more. Flashpoint because it does come out. Oh, but good rotation. It's King. He's gonna find one before getting traded away by Subby. But overall, it's a three for two. Truth for three for one rather trade. As Tadak, they're gonna have to rotate their members over from the A site. I mean, that was like five, six seconds into the round, and uh, RB was already in sight. Mm -hmm. what, what do you do against that? Well, who expects that in the pistol round? Yeah, nobody. Nobody expects that. And unfortunately for Tordog, they're going to be paying the price for it, but also he's still holding up on Heaven's side. It gets smoked off with the cover of darkness. He needs to get down onto the ground, get yep. his feet dirty. They're going to hear footsteps here from both angles. That's a really fantastic pick. The smoke as well, trying to allow his omen to maybe push in at the same time. So now with the, uh, with the paranoia, he didn't check his corners though. Stax actually picks up both as Zess unable to secure the kill. Bit of a risky play here because Aduka, if he dies, mm -hmm. immediately will not have enough savings here to buy for next round, even with the second round loss bonus. So RB immediately into sight. Look at this man! He's and so you're fast. just dead. You're just dead, Riz. Ah, he's so fast. He's such a good entry fragger here. Oh, wait, he does actually spot out the Sage Wall yeah. coming up just in time, but he's got to clear through that smoke. Hopefully, he can land those last couple of shots, but unfortunately, it doesn't go through. So he's going to be the next to fall down as Glow clears him out. Heaven is still uh, compromised here mm. as the rest of the team cleans up shop. Good for them. Coming into this uh, coming into this 14th round, the actual 14th round, not my dyslexic 14th round. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, and I hate to correct you again, but it's actually the 15th round. God, you kind of just <laughs> have to raid on my parade there. Zest is going to be good and aggressive, but again, RB just right back there, trading one for one there with Senna. Tadak have three versus the four of Vision Strikers currently standing, and if Vision Strikers wins this round, Tadak are going to be forced to just buy whatever they can. Conveniently called the force, mm -hmm, but they're mm -hmm. going to be just such at a mismatch here. It's looking so difficult now for Tadak. This is pretty interesting. They pushed through mid, they went into ropes, and then they got back out of ropes and rotated towards B side. Now, the doctor, he's got a lot up ahead of him. He needs to be able to win this gunfight. He takes out RB. He sees to it's time to flat out. Oh, it's time to drop down that fault line and force them onto the site and wait for that rotation coming in from Sova. Duka's 9 HP here. It is a 3 versus 3. There's one holding Raptors, one in back of sight, and one now just planting. We'll see what the doctor can get it done. He's going to prescribe death there to the omen oh. now as Zest will trade him away. Whew, he's, uh, that's a bit of malpractice there from that doctor. Yeah, but that was just a great shot coming out of Sage this time around. Jet trying to make sure that she gets the angle here. They're wide swinging on top of her. Subby, you should be careful, but he's watching that left side. So the team is looking to try and make this happen. The aftershock comes out, doesn't connect. He's still got to look right, nice but job. that's when Zest catches him off. Vision Strikers, and we'll see here. Tadak going to be rotating on through. This would be a big oh. kill, but RB is going to crouch under those shots and snag that one there looking around through the sewers. Another 4v5 here, the weapon mismatch, and not a whole lot of damage being dealt there to RB either, as we're really quite split now on the side of uh, Tadak. Everyone kind of just lurking and, and, and peeking and seeing what they can find here, but it's only going to be one man now watching B and two holding A, but it's only the Lurker Cypher now who will drop back after dropping the smoke to now rejoin the rest of the team as they look to push mid. Mm -hmm. They're just walking up mid. They gotta check their corners, and this time Aduka is gonna have to be forced backwards. All he has is a marshal. He can't just spray transfer like he usually does. But mm, well, it's not connecting here. No, no, it's unlucky for him. Now is not having control. Will be given on over to Vision Striker. Senna looking for one. Will only get RB. Traded away by King. A three versus four scenario as King is gonna find a third as well, and he's looking for that last one here on the breach. RB is dead this time, so he can't. 
steal away this 4k, but it's going to be all up to the last remaining uh, breach here to try and clutch this one out for Tadak. Mm -hmm. Yep, they're just hold they know for a fact, yeah, they could just play this until Kingdom Come, and there's nothing that Doctor can really do about this. He, he barely has enough utility to make this work. The Aftershock isn't going to get anybody, but uh, uh, even then, that's going to be 